Hey guys, I hope that you're all doing well and welcome back. Let's play some more EU4. In, uh, we are finishing up some doozies of wars, but I think it's actually going quite well for us. Just need to kill off some men and, uh, you know, what better way to do that than in a war where we're enforcing a beautiful PU on these dudes. These dudes, these goons, these, these bros. Um, we're waiting on these ships to heal up, which they are, so let's go ahead and send you guys over here. I don't think we need to be too concerned about, uh... Let's go ahead and get you guys down there. So these guys, we definitely want to have a guy over here. Uh, they have a lot of men over here, actually. They're taking... <laughs> wow, they're taking a lot of attrition down there. That's kind of weird. I've taken a lot of attrition as well. Let's go ahead and just barrage these walls. I think it's to take Vienne. Yes, it is. Okay. As soon as we land some men, we're just gonna white piece Great Britain. Uh, I mean, we'll probably break any alliances that are necessary. We white piece him. <laughs> Excuse me, good little hiccup there. Imperialism against Diviet. Very nice. Oh my gosh, that's some defensiveness. They have defensive ideas. Oh, they're gonna be a really good vassal. Offensive, defensive, admin, diplo, economic. Yeah, they're gonna be a good vassal. Half off trade efficiency guy, correct culture. Nope. Wait, he is. It's cool. Let's crank him up. Get those Diplo points. What's my chances here? 50%? 55%? So they're telling me there's a chance. So... We have as more, many heavies in this fleet alone as he does total. Does he have them all right here? 38 of them. Um, let's see here. Can we get a naval... Mm. Naval morale would be nice. Let's see if we can get a naval morale guy. Let's catch out who we can. Those guys literally just went through me. I'm confused. Okay, that's weird. Alright, so. Let's get you guys grouped up. That was very strange that he literally just teleported his fleet through me because the AI cheats, but that's fine. I'm sure somebody will explain to me how I'm uh, I'm raging because the AI's fleet just didn't get engaged by mine. I was I'm I'm so mad right now, man. Anyways, let's get on to Londinium and go siege that down. Beautiful. It's only a level three fort, so we're in good shape. Man, we need to get some. I don't want to get spy network because I don't want to hurt our relations anymore so they'll be loyal um, in case you didn't know this you actually have to when you have a PU you have to maintain a positive relation or when your monarch dies um, you will lose the PU so it has to be a positive positive. and if it is not you will lose it which the fact that we have a young monarch is a good sign good sign of that let's actually turn that timer on as well Killing off some of his fleets, which is good. He can have all of his men rotting down here. That's fine with me. Oh yeah, he's losing lots of men. I'm losing basically all my men on over here on Tyrol, but I'm just... I don't want to risk, risk uh, getting beat up on, so... You guys are Catholic, dang it. Memigan also wants out, so we'll go ahead and piece them out for Force Religion and all their money. Dang it. There we go. I really want to win some of these sieges we're doing. Looks like my one of my general, one of my naval guys just died. I don't know what just happened, actually. Come on, 57. Come on. Give me the siege, dang it. All right. How are these cores coming along down here? Let's go ahead and suppress rebels over here, just in case. We're still waiting on the cores to happen. Alrighty then, still haven't won London, still haven't won Tyrol. Okay, don't want to take it this far ahead, so we're going to go ahead and spend some money on dev, that's fine. Or admin points I should say on dev. There we go. Won that siege there. I'm going to, the idea is I want to take this and immediately just white piece out Britain. 
Mary Reed, huh? Admiral Mary Reed or admin points. Let's take the Admiral. That sounds good to me. Pretty good as well. Let's actually go ahead and get rid of this dude. And uh, Great Britain. Let's go ahead and get you guys out of here. Carpus him down real quick. Go ahead and blockade some more of his stuff. Kill off his navy. Oh no, he's gonna kill my fleet, kill my men. No! Yeah. Sunk his flagship. There we go. You guys won out, I promise. Ongoing battles, negative four. Interesting. All right, there we go. Now they want out. White piece. That's all there is to it. You don't want this fight, I promise. For some reason, Austria had men up there. We're gonna kill them all off. Let's take a parliament debate. Mercantilism and domestic trade power. Domestic trade power is nice. Um, I'm pretty sure domestic trade power translates to trade power from provinces, but I might be wrong. Army tradition decay. Let's go with that because we've had a lot of issues with our army tradition lately. There we go. And that is probably actually going to keep it so we're growing for a while. Mm, we're close. So let's go ahead and build these dudes over here. I think that's actually... Oh no, we can get one here as well. And then we can build one there as well. Very good. So that will actually put us in the positive now. So our, our floor is going to be like 25. And we can actually improve, which would be nice. So you guys are going to be in a union under me. And you're going to give me all your money. I want them to be in debt. That way I can actually pay it off. And uh, make them like me again. There we go. So they hate me, hate me, hate me so much. They actually hate me a lot because of aggressive expansion, and they forced us into a union. So this is going to be quite tough, actually. Let's see if we can get a improved relations guy. Very good. And uh, let's just speed five it for a moment. Austria is in a personal union under us. We can totally defend his, his land. That's fine with me. Let's have you guys go ahead up to, like... Vienna. I can definitely lose some prestige. Not force marks. Let's go ahead and suppress rebels. We, we care about our 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 subjects, right? The Austrians are are good subjects. They they need they deserve the respect. Um, that's almost done. We're holding off on this one. We're gonna take this one, uh, and that will allow us to get quicker. We can influence him as well, which is good. Um, let's go ahead and go with type of subject, Austria. We will pay off his debt, so he is forever going to be loyal. It's just a matter of making sure that he will have a positive opinion of me. So let's actually go ahead. Oh, he has to be have a positive opinion of me. Hmm. Nationalism, huh? Who would we choose with? Basically everybody because of our coalition war, I think. Oh, this is... Yeah, this is me. Man. We have a truce with everybody. Literally everybody. Who do you have claims on? Commonwealth? Nobody would defend him. Magdeburg. Bohemia will for land? It's fine, I'll give you land, man. Siege him down for me, brother. This is more just to pass the time, because if I give him land, he's going to like me a lot better anyway, so... Let's go ahead and get you guys back over there. And have you guys head on down to uh, go privateer, not privateer, uh, go protect trade in the Côte d'Ivoire, where we are still transferring plenty of trade. Do we need to be doing any of these buttons, though? go with West Africa just to see if that'll actually give us do you think it'll pay itself off I don't 
don't think so. West Africa, right? Yeah, how did that not... It didn't go up at all? Hmm. Interesting. Alright, so... I'm gonna take another idea. Let's go with trade steering. I should actually increase our trade by a decent margin. Oh yeah. We are now past the point where I think money is ever gonna be a problem for the rest of the game. Now we're just at the point where we need to make sure that these guys like us before Sir Francisco Franco dies and uh, we, we will be good. Let's go ahead and improve relations with these guys preemptively. Let's also get you guys over here. Let's get you guys up here and see if we can get the uh, anybody to reinforce us. There we go. Get on over to Warsaw. Army reformer is dad. Well, that's kind of unfortunate. We'll take another one. Hmm. Whatever. We've been so fa far ahead on admin for the entire game. Like for the last few years, I'm not even concerned about it. Good defender of the faith against Russia. Russia, Russia, Russia. So let's get you guys grouped up over here. You guys do not need to be attaching to me. They're down here hiding, I'm pretty sure. They're totally hiding. Wait, where did they go? What? That is so weird. Cool. Well, I'll come on over here then. Seat them down. Oh, there they are. They want to catch these hands. Your funeral, boys. Okay, let's get some more claims on the French as well. There we go. I will not call Scandinavia in on this one. Okay, so let's actually go ahead and pull you back. One more click there is probably in our best interest. A speedy succession for Salzburg, who is still an OPM in Salzburg. Very good. So let's go ahead and give this land to Austria. Nope, that's not true. We're going to take it for ourselves and then we'll give it to Austria. And uh, Bohemia is going to want some land. So I'll give them like one province over here. I don't care if they don't like me. They can be mad. It's fine with me, man. Basically, I just need to make sure that they have very low participation. And right now, they have pretty good participation. So, the less they have, the better. Let's just go ahead and take Miltech. It's fine. Just need to siege them down. Basically, the more men we lose, the more war participation we get. That's the, the long story short of it. There we go. Diplo rep. Alright, we're actually doing pretty well on getting our relationship up with these guys. So let's go ahead and send them a gift. Somehow I clicked off of it, so let's go ahead and give them a gift, like I said. There we go. What is his... What is his income? Yeah, he could probably use some subsidies. So let's go ahead and give him some subsidies since we're filthy rich. I would rather not do that, but if... Uh... Yeah, it's unfortunate, but we'll do it. Um, I'll take the monies. Let's go ahead and... Uh... There we go. Um, what was I going to be doing here? I have some colonists that I need to get out. So let's go ahead and get you guys sorted out over here in California. They still have those guys over there, which is funny. Get rid of you. Get rid of these guys. And uh, get rid of these guys. Very good. And uh, now we just need to siege them down. There we go.
totally fine with me. There we go. Carpet siege, carpet siege, carpet siege. Totally, I'll just take free. Oh, well, not free, but I'll take the army professionalism. Manpower. We're definitely part starting the snowball pretty well. Very good. I'll just give those two provinces to him. He'll be super happy about it. And um, look at this long Wallachia. So he actually has claims on all that as well. So I'll probably take like this province here and keep it to have a border. It's probably fine with me. You guys will go ahead and also give me your war reps and all your money. Or all the money you're going to be willing to give me. There we go. And we are going to go ahead and just give the land to uh, Austria. So you guys will get that one. This one. And then this one. I'll keep that one. Um, actually... Is it because he doesn't have a core there? Okay, well I guess I'll give it to him then. It's fine with me. Is it part of the state? No, it's not. Yeah, that's unfortunate. I don't want to have to deal with that overextension. So these guys are allied to Rusha. Let's see here. Bavaria will not help them. And then Scandinavia will help me, and I have all of these guys here. Let's see how Russia's looking. Can we take on the Russians? Wow, they have a lot of men. Wow, they have... Okay, no, that's us. <laughs> I was going to say, dang, they have a lot of men in the field. Well, we have a war coming up here with these guys. So let's go ahead and actually have these guys brought over here. We're going to have to go to war with the French again quite soon, so let's make sure we are prepared for that. Okay, so let's get you guys grouped up over here. Let's go ahead and uh, get another army down in here. And as soon as our truce is up in February, we will also attack them as well. When is our truce with these guys up? February of 07. go I do need to annex these guys but I kind of don't want to hurt my opinion with anybody ah whatever we'll do it it's fine our uh, friendships with them will be quite good for for a while sorry about my dog barking okay very good we have an extra merchant Let's go ahead and steer down to Genoa. Should help us out a bit. Very good, it will. Yes. Uh, I'm totally down for that. That is a good event. Level eight forts, yes please. Let's go ahead and put some over here in the mountains. And then here. It's actually Build them like here, 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 here. We can actually probably get rid of this one. Let's get rid of this fort. And then let's go ahead. Let's build some over here in, in uh, these provinces here. There we go. Let's build another one there. Let's build one right here, and then one right, one right there. Same with this. That's probably fine with me. Let's make sure that our our vassals have some. Hmm, actually don't know where they, where they actually are at. So, five states owned by Spain in the Mexico regions have assigned holy order. Oh. We don't own literally any land in that area, so let's go ahead and change that, right? Let's go ahead and recall this dude. Let's go ahead and imperialism them. They will call in Zuni. And uh, that's fine. We're going to end up needing to attack Aztec as well. 
who we'll call in Chichimeca, who I will also... Oh, is this not a... Oh, it is Imperialism. We're good. Our advisor is Dad. Let's go ahead and get a new one. Production efficiency is going to be super good for us. And our truce will be up August of this coming year. Enoshin Revolutionaries. Let's just go ahead and uh, suppress their, their rebels for them. And we now have positive relations with uh, Austria, which is great. Now it's positive 14. Very good. Okay, cool. So let's go ahead and make sure we have all the production we need. All that will also tie directly in. Let's go ahead and uh, take out some loans, I suppose. Just one loan, I hope. No, two loans. Three loans. Yeah, three loans. Just two loans. We're good. Integration is a slow process. That actually means that Austria doesn't like me again. That's kind of funny, but it's all good. Let's get you guys over there. Let's get you guys down here, and let's get ready to declare this war here. Um, universal monarchy. So I either need to be member of the HRE, or be empire emperor, or dismantle the HRE. These guys are probably never going to actually vote for me. Mines, Ravensburg, and Magdeburg. Hmm. So Mines is allied to Ravensburg, but not Magdeburg. Magdeburg is allied to the Commonwealth and Silesia. So Silesia is allied to Bohemia, Magdeburg, and Ravensburg, but not Mines. He's not allied to Mines, so we wouldn't be able to right now. Once we can actually attack the um, the Commonwealth again, I think we'll be good to good to do that. Let's go ahead and have half of you guys come on over here into Linz. Choose with Francis up. And we will immediately imperialism his booty. Um, let's go ahead and wrap these guys up over here. And then wrap these guys up over here. Let's just go ahead and finish these wars up. Hopefully they don't join a coalition. That would be quite annoying. Just need to full annex them. Go. Is that an uncolonized province, you sons of guns? What a border gore. Unplayable. Literally unplayable. Alright, cool. Let's go ahead and attack France, and I will call in everybody. Why not, you know? Let's go ahead and march on to Picardy, apparently. And then let's have you guys, with a new general, march on uh, up to Calm. I love these big old wars. So much fun. All right, let's. I didn't actually. I didn't see that he was allied to Mantua. So let's come on down here to Mantua. Very good. Let's go ahead and have you guys blockade all of France. Totally want to just as quickly as I can. Wait a minute. Okay, there we go. Let's see here. Here we go. Beautiful. Oh, I love it. He actually has like no army right now, which is great. Plus we have him blockaded, basically fully blockaded, which is nice. Hmm, I suppose mines would actually ally me. So let's see here. This would actually work. Let's go ahead and take the Holy War. I always love that extra manpower recovery. If I were to ally mines and attack Silesia, I would be able to dismantle the HRE. And then I would be able to just ally Bohemia afterwards as well. So that is what we will do here. We're going to ally him. Ooh, am I losing fleets somewhere? Where did I lose fleet? Oh my gosh, is it down here? You sons of guns who did they have heavies down here jeez oh pete man hmm 
Truce of Great Britain is over. Let's go ahead and split you guys up. There we go. And we just need to win some some stuff eventually. Hopefully we will. We'll see if we ever win this siege again. Okay. Let's do this over here. Come on. There we go. Very good. I'm actually not entirely sure of what all I want to take this war. Um, I would like to take basically as much as I can. Let's see here. Gonna need to win all these sieges first. Let's get Man 2 out of there. It's an imperialism war, so I just need to take his capital and we're good to go. Looks like he has kind of low morale right now as well. Russia's built up quite a bit, actually. What in the world? No, his, his morale has dropped a bit as well. It was like three point or six point seven or six point eight last I looked, so it dropped from something. I don't know why, but there's a ton of events in this game that cause those sorts of things to happen, so. go beautiful we have them basically fully occupied which is great can admittedly probably start working towards a speed five run here <laughs> feels good man let's finish this one up caravan power another merchant because we need it and then let's go over here up to 21 merchants which is just nuts Let's go ahead and navy or trade power map mode. Move you guys down. Oh, yes. Let's go ahead and transfer from here. Let's see here. How's things looking over here? So Florida's not looking too hot, but we can actually have him concede all of these, which is it's super great, actually. And then give me like as much of the English channel as possible. Let's do that. That sounds great. Though, admittedly, we're going to need to... Okay, we're, we're, we're doing okay, actually. Spanish Brazil is being occupied, but all these guys are making their way down. Let's go ahead and get rid of you guys over there. Okay, we'll win the Siege of Parma here. Work our way over there. There we go. There we go. There we go. And uh, we'll be able to get our truce here that we're looking for very soon. We're going to end up having to wrap it up in the next one, though. So I uh, hope you guys are enjoying. And if you are, please show your support. Leave a like on the video. It helps a ton. And if you want to show your support and subscribe to the channel, you can see more of what we got going on here. And uh, don't forget to check out the Discord and the Patreon if you want to support what I do. The links for those are in the description below the video. And with all of that being said, this is Chewy Shoot, and I'll catch you guys later. A big special thanks to Bloodbound92, Valentel, CWG, Dutch Terror, J Clampett, Yudaldo, Classified for Life, Corbett Gaming, Michael Walker, Palmer, Jonathan Crane, Airborne Animal, and all my other awesome supporters on Patreon. I appreciate you guys. Check out the two series linked on the left and the right, and don't forget to subscribe.